horse, Andy. If you grab him without getting bit, we'll keep the name Andy. Okay, here we go. All right. What's up, YouTube? Today we have a very, very special vlog. Get over here real quick. Um, well, no, like, get back over there. Oh. Like, all right, there we go. <laughs> First of all, a big shout out to Aubrey being the wackest one in this family because yeah. she is not rocking a shirt. This little girl just doesn't clean her stuff. She's why we're the super wax. Yep. 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 All right, guys. So we're gonna do. We're gonna today. We're gonna show you guys our top three favorite snakes in this room. I'm gonna show you my top three. Tia's gonna show you her top three. Arby's gonna show you her top three. It's gonna show his top. Ew! Just look at me, <laughs> nasty little kid. You just look at me. And we're all gonna do our own intro. Starting with me. And you guys always know. I always say, "What's up, YouTube?" What's up, YouTube? YouTube. Hey, isn't that a custom girl for No. <laughs> okay. Sorry, Aubrey. Welcome to the vlog. Ace. What's up, YouTube? Dang. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, please, please comment down below. Let us know who had the best intro. My vote already is for Ace. From the youngest to the oldest on the top three snakes in this room. Big dog pop. Pull that thing out. All right, Pop, and what do we have right here? Uh, it's snow. But what kind of snake is this? A hog nose. Why do they call them hog noses? Because their nose are like hogs. Like hogs. <laughs> <laughs> <Hey. laughs> Ace, I love you. I love yeah, you that's too. That's a cool little hog nose, huh? Yeah. All right, show us your second snake. Yeah, that was a wissy wussy thing to do, big guy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Pop, and what do we have right here? This is a black pastel pin traglo. <laughs> pin? <laughs> a pin traglo, huh? <laughs> Guys. <laughs> So my son just made a new jean and this is a black pastel pin triglo. <laughs> honestly, they're only produced over here at AUP. <laughs> but this right here is a black pastel pin stripe ultra glow. And let me see, let's hold it a little bit more pop so we get a little better view. And pop, what do you like about this so much? That's so orange. It's really cool, huh? Yeah. You know what else is cool? What? You. Okay, let's put that one away and this is the third one. All right, Pop, are you ready to show us your third favorite snake? Yes. Okay, and what do you like about the snake? I like that it glows. It glows. Oh. <laughs> let's see. <laughs> oh, snap. And what do we have right here? A, a yellow. A blonde. <laughs> a, blonde. a yellow belly. <laughs> the only thing blonde is you. What do we have right here? A bamboo Mojave. A bamboo Mojave. Oh, and I see what you mean by say how it glows, how it has a nice little yellow line on the spine. Yeah, this thing is beautiful. This thing is really, really cool. All right, Pop, thanks for showing us your three top snakes. You're welcome. Right, so now it's Thanos' turn. So what's been happening since the last time since you fought the Avengers? Well, it went well, but I lost one of my Affinity Stones. And how'd you lose it? I don't know, the next day I saw it and it was gone. I have no idea what you just said. <laughs> You sound like Uncle Jesse, dude. What did you say? The next day I saw it and then it was gone. So the next day you saw it and then it was gone. So <laughs> shouldn't it be where you saw it? No. Not on my wrist. <laughs> oh my god. Jeez. Oh, great. You're gonna copy Ace the snake? No. Oh. It's way cooler. Oh, and what is this? Arbiola? A Mexican black king snake. Shouldn't this just be an us king snake? Yep. And why would why, why would it be called an us king snake? Because we're Mexican. <laughs> so cool. You have horrible techniques to holding the snake, just so you know. Thank you. Oh, it's pooping all over you. You're really <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, Nisa. He just got pooped on. <laughs> all right, Oz. What's your second favorite snake? The pastel lesser. Don't know what the other word is. Spotless Yellow clown. belly clown, spotless clown. <laughs> okay, so right here we have a pastel spot nose yellow belly clown. This right here is a four banger, man. And yes, this snake is super beautiful and it also only has one eye. Yeah, this one's so pretty. So cool. Just like you. Yep. Looking like your daddy. I already know which snake Aubrey's gonna pick. And honestly, I, if I could say, 
which one is her favorite. This has always been her favorite snake for the, I mean, probably since two years ago. She would always grab this thing. And the only reason why, I think, is because it's really, really big. I know what and it is. And you know what it is, too? Yep. <laughs> All right. What, show us, Aubrey. What is it, Aubrey? The pastel clown. This is my girl. Told you. She's always liked it since she was little. <laughs> and Aubrey, what is it that you like about it the most? It's just so big and it's, I love the colors and I love the patterns. It's amazing. Dang, I want to go with something way cooler than that. You're not me. Oh, dang, girl. <laughs> Attitude. <laughs> I know what I like about it, Aubrey? What? That I've had her for two years already and twice the, and the both seasons that I tried breeding her, she's never given me any eggs. Could you believe that? Yeah. So cool, huh? Mm -hmm. Cool snake, you. Aubrey. Yeah, thank you. And now it's the turtle's turn. The one and only but never lonely. Woohoo! <laughs> turtle! <laughs> never! <laughs> <laughs> Do I remember um, back in the day, like in high school, girls would always leave their voicemail. They'd be like, oh, you've reached so-and-so, the one and only but never lonely. Like, I don't know. I don't know anybody who's ever done that. I don't know. It was <laughs> <laughs> All right, Turtle. You ready to show us your culebras? And you have to be honest and really show us your favorite, because I know which one your favorite is. Don't be afraid of grabbing it, seriously. <laughs> <laughs> do you need okay. the stool? I do. Can Some I get cool a stool? kicks. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right, Turtle. So I know where you're going. Um, do you want to give Matt Byram a warning? <sighs> Matt Byram? Turn it off right now. Turn off your YouTube. This is dangerous. Yeah, Byram, seriously, dude. I mean, I, I don't... Dude, if some, someone called him out the other day and said that, it's funny how he has Matt Byram Exotics. He should not have Exotics in his name. Maybe Do you Matt not agree? Byram. It should just Pythons. be Bat... <laughs> bat. <laughs> it should just be Matt Byram Ball Pythons. That's it. Because I think Exotic that's kind of like, you know, like don't tough and word. scary. Don't use that word. It just, I don't know why he's so afraid of them. But okay. okay. Well, here we go, Matt. Big shout out to Barrows too. Oh, Barrows. Oh, 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 oh. zappers. Jesus. I have a feeling it's gonna happen. I don't think so. This is your girl. I mean, your boy. My boy, it's Andy. If you grab him without getting bit, we'll keep the name Andy. His name's Andy no matter what. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. No, it's not. Okay, here we go. You wanna get in the fist fight and find out? <laughs> All right. Do it, do it, night I'll do it. I was trying to get away from you, Ace Jr. Here we go. Dang. Ah. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Dude. That is awesome. All right. So the name's official. As much as I hate it, I've you know there were so much names that I actually really liked on um, on your guys' comments. I liked Ice Cube because the movie Anaconda. I also liked Piccolo and then Sharon from Dragon Ball Z. Those are some cool names. But after the turtle grabbing that thing like a straight up G, handy it is. Man, I was hoping it was gonna bite you. I mean, not that I want you to get bit, but you know it would have been good for views. Right, right. <laughs> All right, turtle. So, good number this one. Is Andy. First one, number two, Yellow Belly Dreamsicle. This thing is a beaut. Oh, I know. It is a beaut. I really like how her yellow pops. I mean, it's so pretty. It's yellow and orange, right? Yeah. So crazy how much of a difference yellow belly does. And let me show you guys the difference. I was going to say, it's a huge difference. And don't get me wrong. I mean, the regular, you know, Dream School looks amazing. But, I mean, compare the yellow belly to just the regular. I mean, the colors just are so much more intensified. Yeah, I mean, way brighter. It's amazing. So cool, you know what's breeding to this? You guys wanna know what's breeding to this? Just remember this. Yellow belly, dreamsicle, female, male, black pastel, asphalt, het lavender. Ooh. Needed to make sure I had to look at the label. <laughs> <laughs> think about it. <laughs> All right. So here it is, here's the comparison, and here's my fave. Okay, and last one, since it's only narrowed down to snakes, could have been something else. Leeches? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Lizards? Definitely. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Tight, is that the Tight. one? Tight, nope. <laughs> <laughs> it's her right here. Oh, she's got a nice shed in there Ooh, too. Ooh, fresh shed. And what's this right here? This is a lavender snow. This what, is our girl, lavender what, snow. What makes a lavender snow? 
Uh, I don't know, because I didn't make it. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's jacked up. Does it have lavender in it? Yeah. <laughs> and snow. Uh, and exantic? Yes, I knew you would though. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this one is a popular snake right here. She is so beautiful. She looks a little dirty from the A little dirty nose, right but she's still really, really pretty. I love how pale she is. Who's prettier, that or that? Well, there's no comparison. She is gorgeous. Oh, I see the lavender. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Turtle. But yeah. All right, guys, it is Big Dog's turn. And I'm not going to show you guys my top three ball pythons. I think I'm only going to show you guys one ball python, to be honest. I'm going to show you guys my favorite snakes here. Honestly, they're just amazing. You guys ready to see Big Dog's favorites? Show them off, Big Dog. You need a stool? No, I'm a gangster. Dude, I'm tall. You guys might think I look short on fi on film. I mean on video, but I'm actually really tall. 5'9 is tall, right? <laughs> Just playing. And right here we have an IMG boa. And man, I've been falling in love with these things more and more. I mean, look at the belly on these things. They're so amazing. Wow. Just look at the colors, man. They're so pretty. Very pretty. So cool. They have so much iridescence like going through them. It's so clean. <laughs> so yeah, so this is my one of my favorite snakes in this room. Actually, a lot of them are my favorites, but you know, this is like one of them, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> one of three? <laughs> one of three. <laughs> Go in there, little dude. All right, and on to my next one. This snake, I hope it's out of shed already. And this is one of my snakes that actually has a name. A lot of our snakes, we don't really name them. I want to say it's only a few of our animals that we've actually named. But this snake right here actually named it Cusco. After Brian Cusco, but it's a female. So actually, I still could have named it Cusco. Hmm, what do you think, Turtle? I think you can keep it Cusco. Cusco? <laughs> so this next one right here. Oh man, it's still in shed. But right here, we have a black eastern indigo and man i wish it wasn't in shed so you guys could see how pretty this thing is i mean you guys seen cusco's before right but this one honestly is a lot nicer than cusco's i mean a lot nicer not like a little nicer a lot nicer it has a big old red face but right now it's really been blue but look at this thing yeah it's definitely nicer than cusco's it really is you know what cusco said he's like oh we should have them fight he's like let's put them in the drawer and whoever you know loses gets eaten and stuff like that and i was like dude costco you don't want to do that with snakes i love these things so costco no i will not accept your challenge i do not want these snakes to get hurt but you know just you know face the facts that mine's a little nicer looking i think mine goes heads up with yours while it's in shed <laughs> just my opinion but yeah guys this is one of my other favorites it's a uh, black eastern indigo and i actually got this cousin cusco he's the one that got me looking into these things and man i do not regret it so cusco big shout out to you brother love you so guys here's my third one and it's none other than this jag retic look at this look how pretty this thing is you know what I like about retics that they just hold their colors, man. As they get older and older, they get brighter and brighter. I mean, I love these things, man. These things are so pretty. And their feeder response is just amazing. Pretty crazy because I've gotten tagged a few times already. And I'm getting phone calls. It's cool. <laughs> Sorry, that kind of got cut off a little bit. Had to get a phone call. I'm telling you, I get calls every day, every second, every minute. Aubrey wants to give a shout out to a friend of his, hers. <laughs> a, a big shout out to Genevieve for always watching our videos. Thank you, Genevieve. Gen Genevieve? Yeah, Genevieve. Big shout out, Genevieve. Thank Am you. I saying it right? Genevieve? Yep. Big shout out, Genevieve. <laughs> Guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. We appreciate all of the support. Until next time, Bye. deuce. Peace. Peace. Bye. <laughs>